Hi, this is Robert Selig with Blue Planet Surf, and today we're going to go over how one of these boards is made, one of our surfboards. I was just recently at the factory and uh, took some video of all the different steps of the construction process. So um, today we're going to show you how one of these boards is made. And uh, we use the Aku shaping machine, which uh, makes a very accurate shape of the board. This is our 10-2 Easy model after it was shaped by the machine. And uh, it uses a big wheel that cuts, cuts the shape. So um, the finished shape board is actually already very, very close to the, the actual finished shape. It just needs a little bit of hand finishing after it comes out of the machine. Okay, so now we'll watch the machine actually shaping a board. Here the blank is attached to the shaping machine track. So the track can move it back and forth under the wheel to shape the top of the board. And here the engineer is looking at the shape again, just making sure everything looks right. On the computer, there's all the different slices of the board. And uh, just looking at the top and bottom, making sure everything looks good. These are the tracks the wheel's going to make along the board. And here the wheel is cutting the foam. Uh, the hat. This is cutting the first half of the deck and now it's cutting the rail and it makes a curved cut from front to back first one side and then the other side and the computer obviously keeps the shape exactly symmetrical so that both sides are exactly identical and which is important it's very difficult to do that hand shaping when i was a kid i used to hand shape some boards in my parents basement and and uh, you know with mixed results obviously if you if you screw something up on a foam blank by hand you can't just add foam back to it so um, and on a computer the nice thing is you can sit on the computer for hours and refine that shape and make make small changes and keep changing until you feel like you get it just right and then you send it to the shaping machine which makes a perfect uh, replica of that design and if you want to make small changes to it later, that's easy to do. You just have to make a small tweak to the program, send a new file, and start all over again. So now you turn the blank over, shaping the bottom contours now. That red X is the track of the wheel. You can follow it on the computer. So the next step in the construction process, once the board's computer shape, it's hand sanded, and then it goes into the glass shop. These are some PVC foam reinforcements in the fin area, and this is the bamboo veneer. This one has a wood veneer. We also have the bamboo veneer construction. So basically, first it gets a layer, a thin layer of glass on top of the foam, then they put on this veneer, bamboo or wood veneer, and then it gets vacu all vacuumed back together onto the board. Once that's done, it gets another layer of glass over the top, and, uh, and some reinforcements on the rails and under the feet. So, so it, uh, it's a multi-step glassing pro process and then um, high, by, by vacuum bagging it and um, it, it gets a, like a nice tight, uh, lightweight construction that's strong, light, and tough. So here's a little video of the vacuum bagging process after the glass gets applied they put on a layer of bamboo veneer and then stick that in the vacuum bag all the air is sucked out and so everything gets compressed together really tightly onto that foam blank and it's done for both the deck and the bottom of the board next we're going to go into the glassing area where they're glassing two carbon fiber boards for us some new race board prototypes that are looking really sharp with um, full carbon construction, which is very light and strong. So this is a new 14 foot all carbon prototype race board, getting a finished coat. Next to it, it's a 12-6 prototype. These are two new boards we're just trying out with the lighter weight carbon construction. Costs a little bit more, but looks really nice and feels very light so far. So we're also trying out some boards for surfing with a bamboo deck and carbon on the rails and bottom. And then this is the oven where the boards are heated up after glassing. 
So next we're going to go into the sanding area where the boards get sanded. And by the way, the bamboo veneer doesn't just look nice on the board, it also adds some performance characteristics. Bamboo is actually one of the lightest, strongest materials on earth. Uh, it has great flex characteristics which makes the board perform well. Here it gets sanded after another 6 ounce layer of glass was glassed over it. And here we see some boards after the sanding and all the inserts are installed. They're ready to go to the paint department to be finished. Here's some of the different shapes on the rack. Okay, so next we're going to go into the polishing area where the boards get polished and finished ready for packaging. So after the boards are spray painted, they get a nice finished coat and uh, then they get polished and buffed out to a nice glossy finish. Uh, here's a couple boards getting getting the final buff, buffing and then afterwards they get the quality control. Everything gets checked before it gets packaged. This paint won't chip off easily like some of the older Santa boards had problems where the rails always chipped off easily. This, this one is very chip resistant although we still recommend getting the rail tape on the rails where, where you always bang it with the paddle. Uh, you know, once that's done, when, once all the glassing's done, they put in the uh, inserts and all our boards have a FCS plug in the nose for a GoPro camera, the two-way vent plug which uses a Gore-Tex membrane to let the board breathe without letting water in or out. You don't have to uh, mess with it, it's always, always automatically vents the board. The lift-up handle which makes it very easy to carry it and transport the board. And two leash plugs in the tail. So, and then it gets packaged up. All our boards include a padded board bag, which um, saves on packaging materials and it gives you a free bag included with the board. And it gets shipped to our shop where you can buy it at a very good price. Thank you.